Behind me today is the LPX, a staple in the equipment trailer lineup of Diamond C. This one's heavily optioned and ready to go to work. Let's go take a look at it. Starting at the front, this LPX was outfitted with the engineered gooseneck package. The LPX is available in bumper pull or gooseneck. It comes down to mainly preference of which one you'd like to use. If you use more of the bed space of the pickup, the bumper pull may be the way you need to go. But if you like the way a gooseneck uh, distributes the weight of the load up the frame of the truck, the gooseneck may be the way to go for you. On all Diamond C gooseneck packages, you get the full width neck box. This trailer actually has hydraulic jacks, so your pump and battery live in the front box with the 110 charger there, but still half of the box gives you storage for straps, chains, things of that nature that you need to get to the job site. The box is actually lockable as well. As I mentioned, this one has hydraulic landing gear on it, which is super cool. If you unhook and hook a lot or even a little, uh, the hydraulic landing gear will make you throw rocks at normal jacks just because you in this weather so today is a july day 105 degrees you're getting out to unhook and you just simply press the button up down and you're hooked up very quickly moving on back you'll see this deck is extra wide it's got diamond plate on the outside of what would normally be the frame it's got the rub rail out to the edge of the fender this is what we are calling the max wide option. It's 102 width on the outside of the rub rail to outside of rub rail, and it includes drive over fenders. The cool thing is it allows you to use that deck space. Say you don't need to drive over the fenders all the time, but you want the extra width as a uh, deck over flatbed would have. You can be able to side load palleted goods on here, have the full width of it, have plenty of tie down down the sides, and then if you have say a truck that is over width or a piece of equipment that's over width uh, from the eight normal 82 between the fenders you can actually drive over the fenders very easily you got a nice gradual incline and decline over the fenders so if you need to haul a piece of equipment again that's outside the width of between the fenders super easy to do this one was outfitted with blackwood outer so what that means is just the outer boards or what i would call runners are blackwood material blackwood is a treated lumber product that has a quarter inch thick piece of rubber infused into the center of it it's great for traction so if you're if you're on here loading and offloading vehicles it's great for traction do not use blackwood if you intend to use anything that has steel tracks or you're going to be hauling um you know palleted goods a lot anything that's going to drag or scrape a lot across it over time Blackwood's not a good, a good fit for you, but if you're hauling mainly vehicles and rubber tired equipment, Blackwood works great. This LPX is a 210, so that means two 10,000 pound axles. They are Lippert uh, torsion axles, oil bath. You see the Valcrum oil caps are standard, has a 215-17-5 wheel and tire. That's a 16-ply regroovable tire, uh, super heavy duty. You know, you get in a trailer like this, typically you're gonna be you know on and off of different job sites in and out of the the field and you know telling what you encounter there as far as stuff on the ground you can't always you know control that obviously and so super puncture resistant and a good long lasting tire moving to the back the lpx has several different loading options available it has a straight deck with sliding ramps you can do a two foot dove with sliding ramps you have the two foot dove here with the uh, 24 inch wide HD knee ramps and then you also have a max ramps option um, for the LPX as well so again this one is a two foot dove with cleats and the 24 inch wide HD knee ramps the cool thing about these ramps are they're spring assisted heavy duty four inch channel construction they are super heavy duty you can see with the um, number six grade expanded metal and then they have a reinforcement on the back side with the two inch square tubing uh, backing up the two inch square tube cleats. So they're super heavy duty. They're great for hauling skid steers, excavators, all of that kind of concentrated weight equipment. They, uh, again, I keep saying heavy duty, it's in the name, they're heavy duty ramps. Backing up to just a few minutes ago when I was talking about the 210 package, the 210 package means this trailer's rated at 20,000 pounds GVWR, that's gross vehicle weight rating. And when we graduate into these heavier packages, that means it includes our signature engineered beam frame technology. So each beam that we produce 
we can control the height and the thickness of it and also which dictates the strength of the beam. And we do that depending on what length it is, what uh, gross weight rating it needs to have. We have full control over that beam and we build it just to fit, like I said, each length and weight combination rather than being just like the rest of the industry and going out and buying a regular old mill spec beam and chopping it up to make it work. We put the metal where it counts the most. The last thing I wanna finish up with is this beautiful white color. We have about eight standard colors that are no charge and a few extra colors that you can pay an upgrade for. The white is awesome looking. It helps you stand out on the job site. It can be your signature color around town. Say you got a fleet of these things and you want people to know when you show up on the job site, you mean business. The white is a DM coating system product, just like the rest of our colors. Powder coat in the trailer industry has had a bad rap for many years because there was several manufacturers who early on chose to take the cheapest or easiest route. The DM coating system is exactly the far opposite of that. We have several videos out there. I encourage you to go watch the videos on the DM coating system and all the necessary in intentional steps that we take to make one incredible coating. That's the DM coating system with Diamond C. Jump on diamondc.com. There you can build an LPX or find other models that fit the work you need to do.